you were tuned in to G5 Jeff TV, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the share button as you come on in and follow your boy on Instagram and Twitter at Box with G5 Jeff TV. Now, I know I'm a boxing channel, but occasionally I talk about UFC, MMA, and all that. But if y'all know me, y'all know I like to get my sports betting in. Y'all know I like to get my sports betting in. And I got a affiliate sponsor coming. I'll announce that real soon. But that's besides the point. Anything newsworthy as far as sports betting is concerned, I'm, I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm going to be completely honest with you. Now, we had the UFC um, pay-per-view card this past Saturday. Uh, UFC Fight Island card. And it was Usman versus Masvidal. And Masvidal was a plus 230. So, basically, he was an underdog. More than a 2-1 to one underdog. So... You put up $100, you win $230 back. Um, that's for my nine betting people out there. So since this pandemic has happened and sports has come back, there's been, I don't know if it's the same person, but it's been some crazy bets coming out of Vegas. Crazy bets coming out of Vegas. But this one, this bet came uh, to William Hill. William Hill is one of the biggest UK sports books out there. And they actually posted that somebody put up 200,000 on Jorge Masvidal. 200,000, which means that 200,000, if Masvidal would have won, he would have got his 200,000 back, plus he would have got 460. He would have got $460,000, so he would have got $660,000 back. His 200 plus another 460 if he would have won. But we all know Masvidal lost, so I know he is pissed right now. He is absolutely pissed. He lost 200,000 on Jorge Masvidal. Now, listen, as a sports betting guy, if if you um, have a belief in somebody, you have a belief in a bet and you got the money to put behind it, you're not betting no rent money or anything like that or, or the daycare money or whatever i'm cool with it go do what you want to do but two hundred thousand after you found out masvidal lost 20 pounds in six days 20 pounds in six days and he's going up against a pure wrestler they say Usman's style is boring because he's a great wrestler but we've seen that throughout the history of the ufc with a lot of great champions they were considered boring because they were straight wrestlers like matt hughes is one of my favorite ufc fighters of all time but some people thought he was boring you understand what i'm saying some people thought he was boring but for somebody to lose 20 pounds in six days six days and going up against a pure wrestler like usman i'm like that's just not a smart bet that's just not a smart bet some people might have liked it but if it was a normal weight cut, I'd have been like, hell yeah, I would have taken, I would have took Masvidal. But once he came out and said he lost twenty pounds in six days, that was the that was the red flag. That was the alert. That was like, hey yo, get away from this bet. Period. Even if you put some on it, put some peanuts on it. Don't put no two hundred racks, two hundred grand. Like whoever that was, man, come hit your boy up, man. Bet with G5 Jeff TV. Listen, we could turn that 200 grand into a million, man. I'll only charge you 15%. I'll only charge you 15%, but your boy will get you right. Your boy will get you right. But he was absolutely crazy for betting 200 grand on a guy that lost 20 pounds in six days. But, hey, the fact that he was able to put up 200,000, he better off than I am right now. But I'd rather be broke and not lose that type of money than to have that type of money and that might have been my last and i i lost two hundred thousand on a guy that lost 20 pounds in six days i'd be sick i'd be sick but y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section g5 jeff tv hit the subscribe button hit the like button please share this video support your boy support good content at all times i appreciate y'all peace